today I've got for you a surprise unboxing. Um, I ummed and ahed and was indecisive about grabbing this for a while, but I thought while I'm not frequenting the pubs and bars, getting horrifically pissed and making a tit of myself, I'm going to spend my money on the tarantula hobby. So I've treated myself to a rather beautiful Asian arboreal. Um, temporary enclosure I've just knocked up for it. Uh, ideally, I'd have a bit more cross ventilation in it, but it should be okay for the month that it's going to live in there until Arachnosis gets some more stock. I'm blaming Tom Moran for creating a run on the enclosures because they have fucking sold out of everything. But yeah, let's get on with the unboxing. treated myself to a Syriopagopus species Valhalla. They're a really rare tarantula. Um, apparently they're really difficult to breed. The girls are super aggressive. Um, so I saw the stock count on the website get lower and lower. And eventually I just thought, fuck it, I've got to get one of these. Otherwise I'm going to be waiting a while to get one. Um, I've set her up in your basic um, arboreal enclosure there. But we have loads of moss uh, to keep some uh, moisture retention in there. It's uh, Asian arboreal, so that's how I believe you should keep. Now, don't know if the camera is going to pick this up. But the spider is right on top of the vial or pot. I don't even know the word I'm looking for. So I'm just wondering how I'm going to do this. So uh, maybe if I go into the enclosure and pop the top. Again, I always use a tub just in case for things such as this. Oh. Furry little fucker. So let's see now. Oh, you're a little bit timid, are you? Don't worry. We've decided to call this one Loki. So hopefully not too much of a trickster. Do not be a little fucker. You get in your new house. I'm going to move that out of the way. Okay. Oh, tentative leg. Oops. She had a jumper. Yep, she's absolutely fine. Hiding out by the water dish now. Apologies for the lower quality video today. I had to knock it together in my lunch hour from work, so I didn't have time to pick my angles or think about what I was saying. Um, hopefully you'll still enjoy seeing the tarantula. I was just very wary that we had a temperature dip overnight in the UK, and I wanted to get the tarantula out and in the warm as quickly as possible. Um, the picture right here I managed to grab uh, just after the little thing took a leap of faith into their new home. So this species grows to be um, eight inches plus, 
And as you can see from the picture coming up, they end up looking absolutely amazing with velvet black contrasting the emerald carapace. So despite the price, I just had to have one. Um, I'll keep everyone updated over here and on my Instagram with how this little one grows up. And of course, I'll put future rehousings on this YouTube channel. So thank you again for watching. It's honestly really appreciated. And as ever, if you've got any questions, comment below. My favourite part of the hobby is interacting with all the awesome, knowledgeable people on here. So your comments are always welcome. And I do learn a lot from them. So see you all next time.